good people on. Good morning. It's at, you know, it's actually like noon, but my name's Trevor. Welcome back to the Archivet YouTube channel. And today, man, I'm not feeling that great. <clears throat> I just, uh, I don't know what it is. Anyways, I've got my Jesus Calling devotional book here, and today is Saturday, September 4th. So let's go ahead and read it. In closeness to me, you are safe. In the intimacy of my presence, you are energized. No matter where you are in the world, you know you belong when you sense my nearness. Ever since the fall, man has experienced a, ga a gaping emptiness that only my presence can fill. I designed you for close communication with your creator. How I, am, how I enjoyed walking in the garden with Adam and Eve before the evil one deceived them. When you commune with me in the garden of your heart, both you and I are blessed. This is my way of living in the world, through you. Together we will push back the darkness, for I am the light of the world. Pretty good one. So we had, we had some storms, some rains. It's starting to, it finally is getting sunny out and... The boys done been out here played in that mud hole, which, you know, whatever, that's fine. I don't mind. They could go have some fun in it. But, oh, man. I'm waiting for my, waiting for my stuff to kick in here. Should kick in pretty soon. And I should start feeling a lot better. However, my buddy, he goes, hey, ready to hit some holes today? And by holes, he means mud holes. <laughs> And for those of you that know, Dora is front wheel drive. She is not four wheel drive. However, he's got a four wheel drive pickup truck. So we might go down some, go find some trails to go ride today. And we'll take you guys along. And we're supposed to be doing that late, so that means that this video is going to be late tonight as well. However, I think. I think it's okay because it's gonna still be out before the day is over at midnight. And I hope that you guys are having a great uh, Labor Day weekend. I wish it wasn't so wet out here. You know, I I talked about putting up the tent, but with it being as wet as it is, uh, it's not worth putting up the tent. Kansas man. <laughs> <sighs> Gosh, I don't know if I just like I slept wrong or what. It's probably honestly, it's probably the rain because every time we get a storm, that barometric uh, pressure changes, and then it messes with it messes with me. It just it does. Anyways, oh, let's uh, let's just go ahead and cut to some trail, some bogging, some bogging. We're gonna go bogging. Some mud, hitting some holes, getting the poles. Wait, what? Puddle, I put every tool in that toolbox so that can fix it. So you can fix it? Yeah. So we're gonna do a little walk around, like show you guys how dirty the car is right now. We're doing muddy. We're doing muddy. We're doing muddy. And there we go. There's Miss Dora. Here's Jeff's truck. Oh wait, hold on. We we totally gotta show you this. Yep. R2 vet pickup truck. I'm pretty sure your truck's cleaner than Dora. For now. <laughs> For now. <laughs> Whoa, dumb dumb. And this we flex sealed. Well, okay, Jessica flex sealed. Okay, bye Riley. Bye. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see how let's see how Jeff fares on this on this hole before we go and hit it. 
Oh, you like barely went in there. Go in it. Ooh, that was a deep one. Hold on, here we're gonna hit this side. I just had a feel. I just bought some land and we just go out and some land. Oh, shit, boys. Oh. Oh. 
We didn't hit the deep spot that you hit. <laughs> oh my god. Your truck literally went like down. I was like.
hole right there. Another little mud hole right up here. see some wildlife out here <clears throat> like foxes yeah like wolf live out here yeah they could wolves coyotes deer turkeys foxes wolves you wolves mountain Wait, lion no Let's not show you, let's not review. Oh my, oh my lord. Cohen, you gotta get out here and see this, bro. Oh, dang! It came out of the garage. Whew. So much dust. What in the world? Look, it looks like it came out of the garage. Or something. I promise it wasn't that mud hole. Dead. But usually it is. It looks, Are you ready? It looks like it came out oh, of the garage, wow. but it got so dusty. Here you guys go. Don't wipe it. Oh my gosh. Did everybody just cringe right then? Oh Don't wipe it. Stop wiping it. Stop touching it. You're going to scratch the paint. It, Dad. No, your brothers are wiping it off. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh. Oh, so muddy. And check out them wheels. This right here is why. Nope, Jeff's truck. Uh, yep, sorry, Jeff. <laughs> Dora needs a bath head to toe. Like, dang. Let's check out these dollar mud flaps. Oh, yeah, they're kicking butt, fam. They kick butt dollar mud flaps. If you want a set, I'll hook you up for $20. <laughs> uh oh. Really? Are you really pouring red Powerade on my car? Don't, no, oh my god. We determined that the red stuff is Adi's Powerade. Ugh. I didn't even want him to wash it. Oh wow, look at that wheel, that wheel's real dirty. I think this side's worse. Dang. Hold on, let's check this out. Ready, go. Wow. Look at that. Let's go ahead and give that over to the guys over at the Clean Freaks. I mean, I know it's not, it hasn't been ceramic coated. It was only done for a year, but it still works. All right, Jeff. Uh, you need some wheel spacers. Nah. And... Uh, did you way. did you go through the same mud holes as us? <laughs> Jeff hit. I, I feel like Jeff hit him harder than we did. He had some. He had some roosters going up. What kind of ceramic coating is this? <laughs> Shoot. Oh. If you guys enjoyed that video, smash that thumbs up. Don't forget to click that red subscribe button. And then drop a comment. Hashtag spray paint hood. Hey, that is dirty. Look at that. It's a cool little theme. Don't forget to ask your friends to also subscribe. Have a <laughs> oh, for sure. <laughs> Have a great day.
great night. We'll catch you tomorrow in another daily Arctic vet video. God bless y'all.